Hey, Garnet. I was just wondering, as um, a veteran with a relatively successful NHL career, what makes the Flyers run a rebuild state, a destination that was designed? How many times is she going to ask this question? Yeah, you know, there's, there's really a lot of things I go into. Um, when I look at it, it's, it's an organization that... A hot mic moment that embarrassed an entire franchise took place in an introductory Zoom call for newly signed winger Garnet Hathaway. The staffers of the Flyers directed their hate towards Gianna Hahn, seen here. She covers the team on the beat for the Philadelphia Inquirer. In case you missed it, Hahn simply asked the player, I was just wondering as a veteran with a relatively successful NHL career, what makes the Flyers, who are in a rebuilt state, a destination that was desirable to you? You know why this question is fair? and didn't receive, should not receive rather, any criticism because he just came from the Boston Bruins. The best regular season team ever. To an organization like Philadelphia, who hasn't made the playoffs since 2020. It's a legitimate question and doesn't deserve any backlash whatsoever. How many times is she going to ask this blanking question a Flyers rep uttered on the call? Then when Hathaway began his answer, we heard a flyer suck in the background. New president of hockey operations, Keith Jones, the same man hockey fans saw on NHL broadcast for NBC Sports, has had to put out a unique kind of fire not even two months into the job. His statement via the team's official social media accounts would read as follows. Earlier today, our team's social media account streamed a recording of a virtual press conference, which included disrespectful remarks by members of our social media staff. On behalf of the entire organization, I want to extend our apologies. Any disrespect towards reporters is completely unacceptable, especially when they are simply doing their job. We have reached out to the reporter, an outlet personally to express our regret and will continue to promote an environment of mutual respect when working with media. Molly Walker, beat writer for the New York Rangers and National Hockey League, would tweet about the hot mic situation. Gotta love when the Flyers PR department gets caught on a hot mic ripping a reporter's perfectly valid question during a press conference. Tweets it out. And then deletes it. What a joke. The lack of respect is mind-boggling. Be better. Hathaway's contract with the club is a two-year, $4.75 million deal. They have not made the playoffs since 2020. General Manager Danny Briere told Philly sports radio station WIP the Flyers organization were completely embarrassed by that. It's not who we are. Yesterday was a tough mistake that we're all learning from. Awful announcing would add more to the story. Barraging reporters has unfortunately been a trend within the Flyers organization, as head coach John Tortorella has been notorious for shutting down reasonable questions from reporters in the past. He even did a very similar thing to Gianna Hahn back in February. 